Hello, <laughs> dear friends, my lovely audience. Welcome back to the East West Show. Jack Shaw on the East West Show with G N E TV. We all complain about life. As a matter of fact, when you look, when you take a serious look at life, though, maybe partially there are things that you can laugh about, you feel happy about, and partially there's、uh, well, sometimes nearly half of the stuff that you want to cry about, cry about. So. To cry or to laugh, we all we all like、uh, comedies.、Right? In my case, myself, I like、uh, stand-up comedy, and guys can turn you into a laughter machine within two seconds or something like that. Those are magic. I'm not surprised if I come across 100、uh, stand-up comedians. I will get surprised. I am surprised, such as now, to introduce you. A big friend of mine. Her name is Heidi Law, a stand-up comedian, and of course she is a woman, and she is of Chinese origin. So, welcome to my show, Heidi. <laughs> thank you, thank you for having us on. So, normally the performance is how the MCs do when you do a stand-up comedian. Say, hey, folks, here's Heidi. Like that kind of thing. Yeah, they just say hi. This is、uh, Heidi. Yeah, that's it. All right. Good, <laughs> good, good, good. And to the right hand side、mm -hmm. of、uh, Heidi is her lovely husband,、mm -hmm. who I met、uh, about ten years ago on a radio show,、mm -hmm. talking about on a first day. I believe、mm -hmm. that you were there too, the、mm -hmm. both of you,、mm -hmm. talking about the degradable packaging,、yeah. which is the kind of a plastic、yeah. that gets dissolved. Buried in earth with water or something、That's、like、right. that kind、yeah. of thing,、yeah. and that time you were a commentator,、mm -hmm. you were an activist,、mm -hmm. and all of a sudden,、mm -hmm. well, we're talking about、mm -hmm. a, a well-known <laughs> stand-up comedian. <laughs> well, that 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 itself <laughs> indicates how magic life is. Yes. So, so yeah. welcome、mm -hmm. to the show, and、uh, her husband is doing the book binding business,、mm -hmm. right? And a very kind of I can't say nerdy, <laughs> but the old style gentleman. Am I right? No, I'm old. All right, old. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Mr. Uh, Ludwig Moore. I hope I'm right.、Mm -hmm. When I I do exercise、mm -hmm. a little German back home, I still、mm -hmm. feel kind of a little tongue twisting.、Uh, Mr. Ludwig Moore. Uh, being with her, oh, you got how long? You guys have been married? Twelve years. Yeah, twelve <laughs> years.、Uh, twelve years. So in how long was it? Like one hundred twenty. Ah, yeah, I agree. One hundred twenty how long years? I agree. Okay. Any dog years? No. <laughs> 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 dog years only two. Two. The、okay. less than two. Right, yeah. Good. Okay. So let's be a dog. <laughs> better be a dog than <laughs> Hollywood. <laughs> right, okay. Okay. Now.、Uh, With the introduction, I really want to add a few lines.、Uh, she has performed so far the world famous comedy store,、mm -hmm. the Flappers Comedy Club,、mm -hmm. the Second City Hollywood. <laughs> okay, I like the term.、Mm -hmm. The Three Clubs,、mm -hmm. and Tao Comedy Studio, which later、mm -hmm. on will check with you,、mm -hmm. and a U.S. comedy contest for San in San Diego、mm -hmm. and the festivals are、mm -hmm. all kinds.、Mm -hmm. And of course, the nameless or numerous of、uh, uh, cooperation events, right?、Mm -hmm. And、uh, last six months, in last six months, where you may now,、mm -hmm. right? During last six months, starting last September, last December,、yeah. you have been casted in four movies. movies. Yeah, <laughs> that's, a, that's a big success. A woman can. I do, I'm not discriminating <laughs> women. I'm saying a human being. How about that? <laughs> <laughs> a human being can achieve. Within such a short time. When I say short time, I assume that the day after our radio talk, <laughs> walking out of door, you started your comedian business.、No. Till now, it's only ten years. No. No. Right. No. Okay. I, When did you start it? It was about two years ago. I, I was not intentionally to go. Any entertainment business, you know, I'm old. I'm a woman. I can't speak English. No, no, you're、better. a woman. You're, you're you're a woman. You're not old. I'm. I have like a far, far from Hollywood. I couldn't think in anything. I can reach Hollywood. I just took that、uh, comedy writing class. I just for whatever reason, I do not know. My forget Hollywood. <laughs> Hollywood years are too short. Remember, we just confirmed it. Yeah, I know. <laughs>、okay. Comedy. 
<laughs> her entrance into comedy was used as a way to give her more, more self-confidence speaking in in front of a large group. That's correct. I, I actually I teach in college. Mm -hmm. So when I got those teaching job, all my f good friends, my supervisor, my ch uh, department chair, all the tell me, say, Heidi, you need to take uh, um, a card, uh, or, or, or like a language class, like a, a, a non pronunciation class to mm. co correct my pronunciation. You can see my pronunciation is mm -hmm. there. So I can achieve a better job. Mm -hmm. You know, you know what my take is? <laughs> Accent. Yeah. My sometimes might speak better. I I always get calls from uh, the uh, Hollywood agencies. Yeah. They pick up man. They pick uh -huh. a man with me, with uh, like me, like myself, right? With uh, English, with an English that has uh, some kind of an accent. Yeah. Some kind of accent that tells you who who's, who the speaker is. Exactly. Or or everybody speaks like they were yeah. born, they were born by the same mother. Yeah. Something like that, right? Yeah. Okay, good. Go, go ahead. Go so ahead. So I'm I'm very stubborn. I was like, this is really hard. Pronunciation is the exercise of your mouth. I was uh. like, I'm not going to do it. <laughs> so my heart is somehow just keep telling me uh, I gotta take some comedy writing. So there's a catalog from the community college, you know, there's a comedy card. Just so many months, my heart just keep telling me I gotta take that class. Uh -huh. I gotta take that class. Mm -hmm. I was like, finally, I did it. So I oh, went. Oh, you did take a class for comedy writing. Mm -hmm. I never thought I wanna go on the stage, you know, perform, become a comedian. No, I never thought mm -hmm. about that. Mm -hmm. But amazingly, my um, com uh, comedian um, teacher, uh, his name is Adam Barnhart. So he's amazingly bring out the best of me instead of tell me you gotta change this, you gotta change this, you gotta change okay, that. Okay, okay, hold on a minute, hold on a minute. <laughs> I gotta check with my buddy. <laughs> so, did you know that she took a class? Yeah. Oh, she talked talk to you and they asked for permission or say? <laughs> she doesn't have to. Uh, she didn't have to. Well, she can do anything she want, but of course. you think you deserve to know and you did know. Right? <laughs> you didn't know that she took some class. A marriage is a give and take. If you keep secrets, nothing works. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. See that? Mm -hmm. uh, my dear mm -hmm. friends, okay, <laughs> now please open your eyes. <laughs> Peel your eyes open and stretch your ears like this. And now here's something new, the, the culture, mm -hmm. the, 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 the terminology for marriage. I like that. Mm -hmm. I like that. It's sharing. It is mm -hmm. a, it is a, it's a community. I mm -hmm. call marriage a community. You mm -hmm. sometimes agree, right? Mm -hmm. I used to say my wife to, to my wife said even two, mm -hmm. we're a community like that kind of thing, right? Very good. So you uh, learned that she was going to take some classes, and you agreed with her. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, did you agree with her? So in my case, though, I check a little bit. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I agree to her because she is my wife. And she is asking. And I say, okay, go, do it. <laughs> yeah, but when or, it's not sincere for you, it's just, you know, <laughs> it solves the problem at the moment. Uh huh. If you want to be sincere, you support her. No, no, no. I'm talking about different ways of supporting, right? Number one, supporting because I love her. And that's, that's her request. I'll make her happy by saying yes. And number two, support, supporting would be that, hmm, I do see the future. Mm. I do see that uh, sometime later she will be a comedian. That's another kind of support. Which was yours? We didn't even look that far how well yeah. it goes, right? When it was uh -huh. about it was about working out a structure for clean speech, clean pronunciation. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was just. All right. Yeah. I have a my humor is very dry, right? Mm -hmm. So yeah, right. it doesn't work on stage. Because he's, he's funnier than me. Yeah, of course. Right? <laughs> you, you do look <laughs> like a comedian to me. You have, you have the to way have, you talk. You have to have the right crowd. Like yeah. when you look at stand-up comedians nowadays, mm -hmm. most, I would say, use the language a little bit too loose. Mm -hmm. right? You're right, I agree. Whereas, whereas comedians, you know, I grew up in the United States late night and um, forgot his name. Red suit, right? He could sell a curse word because he carried it. 
Mm -hmm. George Carlin, he was the opposite. He did it intellectually. You're right. I prefer the latter. I yeah. prefer the latter. Yeah. Uh, for for me, my take would be the dry kind, mm -hmm. right? So, do you do the uh, dry kind or the uh, juicy kind? <laughs> I do clean kind. You do the clean kind. <laughs> I'm okay. a clean, clean, clean medium. Right. <laughs> Because we met on Earth Day. Yeah, yeah. Very good, we're, very good, we're, yeah. We're, we're clean. Uh -huh. yeah. So back to support though, and how many mm. hours or days mm. or months or mm. so ever mm. did you stay in the program? I stayed in the program first for um, six weeks, every week for two hours. Uh -huh. I never, th again, I never thought I'm going to be a comedian. I, mm. Again, come back to so my So it started teacher. with the yeah. with comedy writing? Yeah, comedy writing. So that's the uh -huh. class I take. But amazingly, in the end of the program, my teacher put me on the world stage comedy club. Mm. Oh my God, I was like, really? I can do that? Ooh. Famous world comedy club? What well, did you do the first the show? I know. Uh, so I, mm. so I, I don't know what I did. I performed, the people laughed, and then end of, end of the show, he told me, what did you say? Do you remember what did you say? Oh. Yeah, he said, you may need to have a career change. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> because, because she's funny and she's clean. Uh -huh. And people okay. respond to that. Yeah. So, um, again, so every time I talk about this, sometimes my tears will just come out. I always say, so why? I said, um, the teacher bring out, again, the best of me. And now give me the freedom to tell me I can achieve whatever I want. Because uh, allow me to say the following. Yeah, all go right? ahead. You are extra lucky. Additionally, you married to a guy <laughs> who is so understanding. That's true. That's true. Right. I personally know a lot of friends who married in a in a mm -hmm. situation like what mm -hmm. yours. Yeah. Right? They lost the freedom, their freedom. I mean, yeah. women friends, yeah, right? They lost true. their freedom the, the moment yeah. they walk in the chapel. That's true. Yeah. No exaggeration. Yeah. That is yeah. true as a solid fact. Yeah. And not only got, he got him understood, yeah. but he supports you, that's but right. he tells you, you need a career change. Yeah, he, you may have a change. <laughs> okay. And uh, that's always him. He always supported me Very to good. be me. Very so good. I think that's also Very another good. thing. Yeah. Uh, my lovely audience, dear ladies and gentlemen, uh, today is a show uh, talking about a comedy, talking about comedian. Mm -hmm. As a matter of fact, to me, if I go, if you go too, mm -hmm. a little deeper to another layer, you will find out it is a, a show talking about life, right? Life is lovable, mm -hmm. life is cryable, mm -hmm. life is feel sorry about, mm -hmm. life is uh, even effable, mm -hmm. right? <laughs> uh, whatever, mm -hmm. to people, mm -hmm. okay? Different ways of dealing it, mm -hmm. Dealing with it, different result. Okay. Marriage is the same thing, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Marriage say, go to a court. Yeah. See how many uh, World War Three, World mm -hmm. War Two, World War Five, World Eleven <laughs> were fighting there. Right? Look at you. I am mm -hmm. confirming here. Mm -hmm. We're talking about a comedian show slash life. Stay with us. <laughs> Hello, <laughs> dear friends, my lovely audience. Welcome back to the show. Getting excited already, Jack Chow, as your host. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm with the GNE TV today. Uh, we'll slow down a little bit. N n no more politics, okay? Mm -hmm. At least for today, we're talking about life. In life, like what I said, we all like uh, comedies. Comedies make, our laugh, make us laugh, makes us feel better. Uh, in comedies, I like the stand-up comedies and I like the stand-up comedians. Mm -hmm. Me, myself, had lots of personal friends being stand-up comedian, but they are. I'm very sorry, they're all men. Mm -hmm. It's a man's world. Mm -hmm. All of a sudden, to see a woman there, my friend, mm -hmm. Heidi Law, or Heidi Law, how mm -hmm. it depends on, well, once again, mm -hmm. pronunciation, mm -hmm. the big word, mm -hmm. he left. That's the kind of humor, right? <laughs> you and I share. The the kind of like uh, the dry, mm -hmm. dry, way. dry one. Anyway, yeah. back to the dry way though. Mm -hmm. uh, we, when you started uh, mm -hmm. uh, 
realize to mm -hmm. realize that mm -hmm. you yourself have mm -hmm. a talent, mm -hmm. especially encouraged by your lovely husband, that mm -hmm. you need a, a great change. Mm -hmm. What did you think? What was the response at that moment? Um, I, w I was uh, more deeply keep asking me how, why, how this com come so deep. So f uh, the coincidence, the funny thing is, that first time I'm on the stage is December 4th. Mm -hmm. on the Comedy store. Oh. My hus uh, my um, father passed away on December eighth, thirty years ago. Oh. So now I always think back if you know people believe all kind of things. So my my um, father is a really funny guy. Had he known that you had the talent, he I would know. have waited for you. I, <laughs> See, I, I was I, thinking he, he would have down to me. He would, <laughs> have, he would have waited. Yeah. Would, now she's saying, oh, I'm sorry, honey. I didn't wait for you. Because <laughs> yeah. I didn't know. Don't blame me, right? Yeah, I was like thinking, so he, he, he's, uh, people love him. He will make a joke from, the, you know, in, in China that time have a long era. You f walk through the every door. You know, in China that life is cool. Mm. People all open the door, especially during summer, they're doing all the things oh, yeah, yeah, outside, yeah, 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 right? Yeah, yeah, so right, he right. will make a joke from the first household until the all end of the household. So oh. people miss him and when he passed away, all the sense of oh. humor. She has the DNA in there. Yeah. She has the comedy DNA. So I do not, so I keep asking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah. So I say maybe that's why. Only, only it was discovered by the amazing teacher. Yeah and confirmed by your lovely husband. Yes. And people are sometimes the, like the following. They might have the talent. For example, you, me, myself, my hidden talent is being uh, Albert Einstein. I'm so sorry until now, has <laughs> nobody has ever discovered. So I'm just waiting. <laughs> it's a song. Mm -hmm. I may wait forever. Mm -hmm. Well, maybe tomorrow somebody says, hey, Jack, mm -hmm. let's be Albert Einstein. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, like that kind of, I may wake up. So most people dying undiscovered mm -hmm. so I'm uh, lucky. You're, you're lucky yeah, you're lucky I'm the very lucky good one. so yeah. the lucky lady from that very point though mm -hmm. uh, did you actually take any classes or so training I've for on stage performing so i actually continued the uh, comedy um, writing and a performing class mm -hmm. uh, then um, I, I take more and after that i just keep going go out to on the stage i think that's the best practice I can. Mm. I was like, I'm too old to start, you know, from the uh, dancing class, you know. <laughs> yeah, 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 I, yeah. I always tell people, I have no talent. I cannot sing. I can dance. <laughs> if, uh, well, nobody will get surprised if you they learn that you, you, you do the <laughs> you got dancing <laughs> by looking at your figures. Well, no problem. Okay. Yeah. But to stand up as a stand Just up be comedy, out there. comedian, mm -hmm. that's really, really, and uh, needs a lot of courage. Just be out lots there. Of lots of guts yeah. to do so. Do not afraid uh, mm -hmm. and fail. I think that's another thing I learned. In the beginning of the um, uh, comedy, not that long, mm -hmm. I, I'm just afraid to start new jokes because mm -hmm. I know the older jokes will work. If I start new jokes, people don't laugh, then the teacher is got me. Yeah, that's <laughs> another, another yeah. issue. Mm -hmm. uh, we would like to, uh, to find out the, uh, the laughing spot. Yeah. If you scratch, yeah. you want to scratch, not <laughs> No more hair, not even one hair up, uh -huh. not even one hair lower, uh -huh. not even one hair left, neither <laughs> right. Just but, right there. But the right there, yeah. the spot though. For that, I have a little insertion to ask my friend. Mm. Though. Uh, you were born here in this country? No. No, right? Mm. So you, in other words, you carried your home uh, tradition, the Dodge tradition, to the American life. Back home though, I'm trying to open another window when I can, just in a by the way situation, mm. for my audience to learn. Mm. Are you one of the exception to treat, to treat your wife like you do? Or it is mm -hmm. tradition back home, everybody, the majority of men treat women like this? It's not country specific. When I was in younger, I mm. traveled a lot. I learned, I lived in different countries sometimes for quite a long time, mm -hmm. to learn my traits from the best people I could find. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And that gives you a different perspective. Mm -hmm. That gives you a wider base. Mm -hmm. And it changes how you think. Mm -hmm. In, when I grew up, 
people went after, you know, it's like in America, people went after status symbols. They wanted the pager, they wanted the job in the office, they wanted the white shirt, they wanted the, the, the sports car. Mm. And you see people not as what they appear to be, mm. the clothing, the, the, the outer side. You mm. see the inner values because mm. they matter. Mm -hmm. All right, what a concept, what yeah. a concept. And, and, and uh, the and se uh, secret I just want to share with you, when we go shopping for the you know, wedding dress, so uh, his friend told me secret in the back. He said, your husband just said, he just want be, you be happy. That's how I decided. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah good, good, that's good, the good. guy. Uh, that's the guy. All right, <laughs> very good. Uh, I'm, I'm just doing a by the way situation, mm -hmm. a by, by the way mm -hmm. manner to open another window uh, mm -hmm. while I can. Mm -hmm. How women are treated back home in Germany, mm -hmm. in, in, in Germany, yeah. right? So mm -hmm. back to your story, mm -hmm. though. What is exactly your first show on mm -hmm. stage mm -hmm. with the audience, not in class? Yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, when was that and how many audience you had? Yeah, it, it was um, um, again December 4th on the comedy store on the Bell Room. I think that, that room probably 67. The very comedy store? Yeah, very comedy store. My, uh, yeah, homework? Yeah. yeah. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> I know. This, I, I, do not, I know. I do not know that's what a, I'm expecting. That's a rocket launch. Yeah, he was in the stage and uh, on the, on the uh, Among audience. audience. Yes, on the audience. Uh -huh. then uh -huh. for, uh, what did you tell? Um, that one. I, I t told the joke about that I was made in China. So that's, I find myself, find, you find yourself niche. How, how long is that? How long is uh, that? About thing? five minutes, uh, four five to five minutes, minutes I think. Okay. Yeah. So, so can you, uh, uh, can we <laughs> taste a bit? Uh, it's difficult. As, as if you, yeah. you're, you're doing now. Beca because it's, I always say the stand comedy, you get to stand up, you can mm -hmm. sit. So I don't know if I can. But you can, you can pretend that you're. Pretend I'm sitting. You can standout. pretend as if. Okay. So, so I s started opening like this. I was like, hi, I was Heidi. Mm -hmm. I was made in China, mm -hmm. but the designer in USA. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, good. <laughs> that's that, that, that's, yeah, that, that's, that's, that's how, cool. That's, that's cool. Then cool. I said, mm -hmm. I said, I said, however, they have made a little bit of mistake on my language program. Mm -hmm. That's why I speak Chinglish. Ah, <laughs> I see, I see. Yeah. And they, and they, made, they made another mistake on the gender selection <laughs> for this business. <laughs> You're right? right, I should have ended that should one. Should have all right. <laughs> okay, my friend, today uh, an opportunity uh, to laugh about, uh, no, but to laugh off, all right, uh, with my friend mm -hmm. uh, Heidi Law mm -hmm. and her lovely husband, mm -hmm. Ludwig, uh, we are really having some time. In the meantime, it sounds like a comedy talk to talk about comedy in mm -hmm. life. Mm -hmm. And yet, as a matter of fact, we're really talking about touching base with you guys about life, how life are to be, life is to be handled, mm -hmm. how things are to be conducted on a day in, day out basis, mm -hmm. and such as marriage, I, we even mentioned a little bit. So, now, when we come back, we will probably give you a little bit about uh, the taste of uh, her comedies, mm -hmm. all right, or comedy style, mm -hmm. something like that, either dry, juicy, or medium, mm -hmm. or whatsoever, mm -hmm. by size, by taste, by so ever. Okay, now, mm -hmm. when you go to restaurant now, 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 now nowadays, nowadays, you say, I want a spicy, mm -hmm. I want a extra spicy, mm -hmm. I want a medium spicy, mm -hmm. right? I want an extra medium. No, you don't. You don't do extra medium. <laughs> okay. okay. Now, so stay with us. We'll be right back. Guys, uh, excited to bring up the next committee. Please give a round of applause for Heidi Lowe. <laughs> region, suppose the U.S., they put it in China, now you know, uh -huh. <laughs> now you know. So my friend told me, say, get it fixed, you know, so I can find a better job. 
So I checked my original warranty expired due to my age. <laughs> <laughs> and I didn't buy extended warranty. Uh, <laughs> I should. I should listen to that sales guy, you know, $16.99 get an extended warranty. I didn't. Yeah, so you know I they usually don't understand what I'm talking, you know, like you difficult to understand me. Uh, like a, like a, I want to ask a direction. I used to live be in the Pico and the La Cienega, so I lost. So I went to the Vons supermarket. I go ask. I say, excuse me, how where is it? Pico and the La Cienega? <laughs> the security guy in the supermarket don't look at me. Say, I'm not sure. Try aisle two. <laughs> <laughs> everything you guys too. <laughs> so I went to the, those uh, video store, you know, that says XXX. <laughs> I was thinking, three out of five stars is not a bad movie. <laughs> She's coming. <laughs> I did that. <clears throat> so I usually don't like go to American restaurant, not because I made it in China. <laughs> the reason is they bring they always ask me, uh, how you wanna be done? Well done, medium cooking, then they bring me a um, salt pepper, then they bring me a knife. I always don't like that. So one day I bring a group of people when the very expensive state house. So kind of encourage me to get brave, start talking. I talk to the waiter, I say, um, now you ask me how to cook, <laughs> right? Then you bring, tell me you season yourself. Then you bring me a knife that says you cut your own food. So what are your cook is doing in the kitchen? <laughs> Well, you know, I will be through other restaurant. Surprisingly, everybody say, yeah, we never <laughs> thought about that. Even the waiter says, very encouraging. <laughs> <laughs> I love comedy, and so lucky you have friends that love comedy. Not all my friends love comedy. So mm -hmm. I saw, the first time I saw, the, you know, the Laugh Factory? somewhere down there mm. have a show. <laughs> it's called uh, um chocolate sunday i was like that's perfect that's perfect you see i bought a ticket for all my friends but they, they are not here anymore so, <laughs> i bought all the tickets to my friends i was like this is wonderful comedy and the chocolate sunday <laughs> so the whole night i was, couldn't understand that a single word those black comedies were talking on the stage. I just keep thinking, where's my chocolate sundae? <laughs> I, I just lost all my friends. They don't talk to me anymore. So tonight, I do not take any chances. I bring tons of candies. <laughs> All right, well, what excellent shows I, I laugh about. We all need it. You, 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 well, you, you need to give yourself a, a big hand for doing that. Thank you. And Thank uh, you. I like those shows. Mm -hmm. I really love the shows. Mm -hmm. I especially like the first one mm -hmm. saying Made in China. China, yeah. I was made in China. That's right. right. Uh -huh. And the, 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 the point, the whole point is that everybody was born with some kind of a defection. Mm hmm right mm -hmm. by philosophy that's right. right and then number one you can hide them exactly right? number two you can show them and that's keep it. them yeah right yeah. for the rest of your life that's number becoming three your special. number three mm -hmm. you can correct them mm -hmm. am i right mm -hmm. so that is the that is the important part mm -hmm. 
of that sh of that show, yeah. and yet in a in a in a joking way. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So that's why my friend Haiti named the show to make the world a lighter place using hum humor and laughter. Yeah. Right. That's yeah. a good way. Yeah. And the, your second one thing, your second one is good too. Oh, the other one, which is, I don't, I don't know. Uh, 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 which your second one or about the XX movies? And stuff? Oh yeah, so yeah. I don't understand. Where was that? Yeah, I saw the uh, XX is a video store. I think three out of five stars not a bad movie. That's yeah. a true story. Whole the thing the clip you just showed the five minutes. It's an all true story. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Happened in see. my life. Your true story. <laughs> all true story. True true story. Yeah. You're like yeah. All right. So before mm. I was ashamed about uh, my pronunciation, so I cannot. Uh, pronounce really good what I do I speak really fast I hide those things mm. now I make a joke it I let it go so right, it's, good, it's good, that's good, all good, that you learn in a comedy uh, you make a joke uh, see about the point <laughs> exactly exactly you so you want to you, you agree with me right <laughs> yeah I mean yeah. you know over the course of our life yeah. sometimes it's a guessing game what she actually is saying <laughs> all right you so want to guess right yeah and, but the, that thing itself is humor, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. That yeah. thing itself is humor. Yeah. Am I right? Okay. Yeah. And uh, for that thing, uh, see, there's another one. The, the one I like best uh. among all uh. the, the five minutes which I saw was uh. that uh, the chef of the steak. Oh, uh, yeah, the steakhouse. The steakhouse that's mm. one. Yeah, I, it's also real, too. I was like, the steak is so expensive, $30. Right, most mm. or even more. Twenty nine ninety nine. Yeah, like say yeah, Elephant yeah. bar, easy. Yeah, mm. and uh, and uh, we went the really expensive one in San Diego, the most yeah, expensive yeah, right. steakhouse, and they, they really come to ask you how to cook. I was yeah, like, yeah. How, to, how to cook? It? <laughs> well, you don't, you, your chef do not, do not even know how to cook. Yeah, and then they even ask you, you cut, you know, chop. I was like, do you go to Chinese restaurant? They do bring you vegetables, tell you to cut it yourself. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So good. I thought I'm the only That's one nuts. Mm -hmm. After I said there's a whole table, we literally have uh -huh. a table like 30 okay. people there with eating food all together. They all laughed. They all so I that gave me another per permission to speak out, make jokes, and make things yes, exactly. we just used to it. And the loss of uh, makes lots of sense. Mm -hmm. It makes lots of sense, mm -hmm. right? And the, the, especially that part. By 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 logic, what kind of thinking she, mm. is she using <laughs> to point out that <laughs> if the chef do know or do not know how to cook? If the material you I know use, you're a book man, right? <laughs> you do book. Book is your life. Yeah, I teach and stuff. Mm -hmm. If the material you use as a stand up comedian comes out of your life, when you tell the story on stage, uh. you have a conviction. <laughs> if you make it up, people can feel it. That's right, people can feel it. And when there's no connection between the public in the room and the comedian. Yeah, that uh, has to be from the Every great comedian always told stories mm -hmm. out of his life, out of observations, something he yeah. saw. Stand-up comedy is like the, the strip, the comic strip you see in the, in the newspapers. Mm -hmm. Four fields. Beginning and this is the whole story. You have to be able to recognize it, compact it, and tell it. Yeah. In a very, very compact way. Yeah. In a true way. Yeah. It yeah, yeah, can't yeah. be made in up. In a true way. Yeah. Okay. I like the part say by that I you rethink about the one I was made in China, in China uh -huh. but designed here. Yeah. You don't make something before designing. <laughs> Am I right? Yeah. So you were that way, mm -hmm. kind of like uh, making it self contradictory mm -hmm. to each other, yeah. and to do to bring the defect yeah. into life that's to right. let them crack you. Yeah, right. That's a good yeah. point. Yeah. That's a good philosophy too. The recipe. So was that a success for the first show? Yeah, that so five it's minutes. It's really successful and uh, really. What we show just audience is yeah. just a re uh, rerun of that show. Yeah, right? rerun that show. Uh, rerun it's a real, really give. Bring me, give me the confidence, give me the permission to go on, continue on the stage. Because as I said, I never prepare for life 
anywhere close to Hollywood. Mm. <laughs> never, ever. I never saw that I talent on anything perform. Mm. So this really gave me the permission to go on and free me. Um, I feel proud of you, yeah, not only you. for your request, mm. also you have the talent, thank but the you. smart way of doing it. Thank you. And the, uh, in her said case though, do you think that her particular perspective from where she is born, where she was born, from who she is, that provided her lots of benefit. So uh, nobody can change, can challenge, because she has to, uh, somebody if they challenge, they have to they be born in Shanghai. That's right, it's a To be brought yeah. here at a certain age there's or something. Lot, there's a lot of experience in that way she mm. can draw on. Yeah, mm. yeah, yeah. The, the, just in that five minutes is 20 uh, years other of word, life. Yeah. In other words, you were created, you were yeah. born that way. Yeah. The specific yeah. way yeah. that fits in the re requirement That's or right. what whatsoever, <laughs> or the test for a yeah. stand-up comedian, yeah. all right? My dear friends, my lovely audiences, uh, today is a wonderful show. I enjoy the subject because I feel sometimes I really need to joke up a little bit to well, let's say shake off the, 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 the way, the burden, the extra duty of life, so on and so forth. Either you're talking about, no, regardless of you're talking about your job, you're talking about family, you're talking about your wife on your back, so on and so forth, so, 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 so forth. You really need some time good, to good laugh, to laugh the good way, mm. to shake it off, right? Yeah. Today, uh, with me, thank God, a <laughs> friend of mine, um, Heidi Law, has become a great comedian, stand-up comedian, mm. and with her lovely husband, Lubwig, joining me for the moment. Mm. We would uh, probably, from a life perspective, to see how important it is that we see comedies rather than newspapers. Mm -hmm. How about that? Yeah. Right. Comedy versus newspaper? Yeah, <laughs> okay, very good. Okay, so Not we'll be right back. <laughs> Hello, lovely friends, my dear audience. Today, in the show with a long title called Make the World a Lighter Place mm -hmm. Using Humor and Laughter, uh, we really have a good time. I'm, I and my team, my team and I, are especially honored by mm -hmm. the attendance of my good friend, Heidi Law, mm -hmm. now a famous stand-up comedian. <laughs> I don't well, the good part is that I'll, I don't have to pay her. She <laughs> doesn't pay me. <laughs> she doesn't have to pay me anyway. Uh, and her husband, uh, Lubwig uh, Moore. Mm -hmm. Mr. Moore is in the book business. Mm -hmm. in, he teaches also the book business. So the combination mm -hmm. for that kind of marriage, I would say, provides, have, has provided the, 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 the call it, uh, Incubator, <laughs> okay, yeah. The incubator, yeah. For somebody of you, yeah. of a stand-up comedian, yeah. to be born enough. That's true. The confidence. So the confidence right? that he gave to me, my parents gave to me. It's all in. That's bringing exactly. out of me to the on the stage. Exactly. It's exactly. not. It it, it uh -huh. is happening one night, but it's not. It's my whole I was life. joking to myself just uh, now. Uh, I could have been discovered with the talent of. Uh, yeah. Uh, Isaac Newton, for example, yes. right? Yeah. I still remain not Isaac Newton because mm -hmm. nobody has really discovered me. Mm -hmm. I may just, uh, well, just refrain myself mm -hmm. for the rest of my life until somebody does it. Yeah. You know, the whole thing. Now, in your case, though, you could be Mrs. Moore mm -hmm. forever mm -hmm. without having your talent mm -hmm. discovered. Mm -hmm. It's kind of thing. So that exactly is life, right? Yeah. And I appreciate the fact that you. Uh, share your thoughts with me about your German tradition, right? And also the fact he is well traveled. Yes. The well traveled, mm -hmm. very, very well traveled. Mm -hmm. So, so now, what's your take, mm -hmm. right? All together, mm -hmm. I know that you have the 100 support from him, which mm -hmm. is number one support. Yeah. And uh, I mean, how important do you see mm -hmm. yourself mm -hmm. 
to the great cause mm -hmm. that you call for it. <laughs> How I about think that? It, it, yes, it is important that then. I think I always think things happen to for a reason. Um, when I go to the comedy the world, I was like, oh my God! If I never be comedy world and I died today, I just miss the whole half the world. Oh. Uh -huh. So I always in academic business for up to two years ago, uh -huh. and the comedy world is allow me to, I call the tribal people's minds. Mm. So the words come out of those comedians, I never even thought about it. Not as able to say it. That's why I'm a clean comedian, mm. but I appreciate. I missed that half. I was like, how could that happen? All the thoughts, all the things they do. And comedian is detailed, very detailed, very observant of life. That's why they can make a joke of it. So that's why, oh my God, I so appreciate it. I had a chance to travel people's world. That's number one. Number two is, the reason is the love to make a light, people a light, a light world is because now the big business don't all realize it because it's easy to deliver difficult message if you use humor. So Cisco, Google, all the big company, they hire comedian, training the CEOs, uh, training uh. the top managers to use humor, use laughter to deliver a tough message. Mm. And training the employees to laugh themselves. So it is. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Speaking of uh, uh, that, I came across a big, uh, big, big billboard mm -hmm. the other day. I believe it's from uh, Kentucky Chicken, mm -hmm. right? And there is a, uh, a bucket of, of of chicken, fried chicken, mm -hmm. uh, those drumsticks, stuff like that. All right. And the word says, all bosses, all bosses mm -hmm. like fried chickens or something <laughs> yeah. or, or like drumsticks uh -huh. Uh -huh. put it that way mm -hmm. that's the whole advertising yeah does that make sense to you <laughs> that's the, the kind of a humor you In, you <laughs> might, might, uh, might be you are talking about when you as I said I teach when you have a generation which completely lives more or less in a digital world where everything happens with her two phones they lose the ability for social interaction. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They don't write letters. Mm -hmm. They don't communicate. Everything is three letter abbreviations. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 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 okay. Mm -hmm. When you try to teach them, it goes straight over the head. Mm -hmm. If you package it in a way they can understand it because it's funny, they remember it. That's right. Because they have an attention span which is so shorter short. <laughs> than a fleeing segment. Mm -hmm. Exactly. But exactly. apply to everywhere. Like this kind of a dry, dry humor, mm -hmm. right? Say all bosses, mm -hmm. all bo why bosses? Mm -hmm. Or why don't say everybody, mm -hmm. everyone, mm -hmm. everyone likes a fried, uh, fr a fried drumsticks. <laughs> fried right? drumsticks. Uh, okay. Or or even drumsticks. Okay. Like yeah. all bosses like drumsticks. Yeah. Yeah. You know what it means? What does it mean? Right. The hidden mm -hmm. meaning is behind, mm -hmm. way behind. Mm -hmm. If you are late for your job, mm. right, to stop by oh. a Kentucky chicken, yeah. buy a box of fried drum drumsticks, so then we'll get and it. give it to your mm. boss, say, oh yeah. Yeah, uh -oh. you are okay. Because <laughs> it's not politically correct. <laughs> no? What? No. Okay, what could it have been? <laughs> it's just, sometimes advertising people just try to be too clever. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it's not an intellectual exercise. No? Mm. No. Mm. Oh, I thought it makes sense. I thought it makes lots of extra sense. You're in California, you have to be politically correct. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, that itself is a joke, right? Yes. In California, no, you have to be, be politically, politically correct. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Like she says, mm -hmm. she did not know the other side of the world yeah. until mm -hmm. she discovered the whole world yeah. of, of, of comedy, yeah. right? I thought I didn't know the other side of the world mm -hmm. until yeah. the third bathroom law <laughs> was, was approved. Yeah. Now that I know the whole world, I can do it. I can go <laughs> any of the of the restrooms. Mm -hmm. I can go to go to the ladies room too, because <laughs> that very moment I felt I'm a lady. <laughs> How about that? So that is. I do not know that. It's, I, it's I got to discover that part. 
correctly, it's <laughs> man, woman, whatever. Whatever, yeah. <laughs> because <laughs> otherwise it gets too conv convoluted. <laughs> <laughs> man, woman, and whatever. Okay. God. Whatever has a lot of has endless of uh, mm. of uh, connotation. Mm. You can add anything on it. Mm. You and I need to talk. Mm. We can go whatever. Oh, okay. So right? n n talk about back to comedian. So uh, you know, um, uh, uh, lesbian, gay, lesbian, transgender people. Their life is really tough. You know, you know, it's mm -hmm. not accepted by m not most people. Some mm -hmm. people. So that life is tough. So I do. Uh, have an interaction with those group of comedians. Oh, they I laugh see. at them. I love their jokes. So the one joke only transgender people can do. I cannot. I don't know if it's allowed to say on TV. Yeah, sure, please. So <laughs> he, he, she, uh, she says, I come to California. So she's transgender. A woman, uh, man become a woman. Mm. She said, I come to California so I can pee. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you get it. Oh, no, I get it. I get it. I get it. So, I get it. Mm. So it help people with mm. a mental illness, uh, with a, a addiction, w with a, a, any issues. They l first they gotta accept themselves, and then laugh, and then the, when they use a comedy to bring awareness too. So. And also mm. uh, laughter with humor, mm. laughter whatever mm -hmm. that is the comedy combined, right? Mm -hmm. the, it makes life easier. Yeah. Right. Make it lighter. I, I, yeah, <laughs> well. I like the 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 the, 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 the mm -hmm. word mm -hmm. lighter. Yeah. Mm -hmm. When I first came across the line, mm -hmm. I wasn't happy, very comfortable uh, uh. with the word lighter. Uh -huh. Lighter might have a negative connotation mm -hmm. to the word, to the meaning itself. Mm -hmm. Yeah. How oh, I say better? How about better? Mm -hmm. Right. Lighter. And now <laughs> I agree. Got it. I uh, agree. Why you say lighter? You chose the letter lighter, lighter. Mm -hmm. instead of better. Mm -hmm. Right. Because mm -hmm. we have lots of weight. Yeah, I know. We oh, show yeah. on your shoulder, right. especially. Right. And then you yeah. get it lighter. You need right. a lighter. Yeah. Uh, to make the world lighter, so I know that it is a, <laughs> it is a very important to do so. Mm -hmm. Another important is that is to make uh, eighty minutes out of an hour. That is so important because we're over time. <laughs> uh, with my friend Heidi, a uh, stand-up comedian, we're not done. Mm -hmm. I still have to, to 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 ask about uh, lots of uh, other questions. Mm -hmm. And when I'm with my friend Lubrick, and I still have to share with the audiences all together some of your thoughts, mm -hmm. and I would uh, schedule another show to promise my audience it will come back, right? So mm -hmm. I believe today the points are, the points are checked. I believe we can call it a very nice show. Thank mm -hmm. you for watching, my dear friends. And to mm -hmm. those of you, thank you. Thank you. you. Thank All you right. for having us. Hey, thank you. Luke. <laughs>